50 foot extension cord. This is the second way on how to roll it up. Okay, I'm going to plug in the ends. Now I need to get the cord out kind of lengthwise, make it all flat. I need to find the other end of that, the exact opposite end. So I can do it one of two ways. I can pull this cord way down the road and keep pulling, pulling, pulling until I know where the end is, and I can walk this back. But if you're in a short area like this, you're just going to take this and keep that there. Now I'm just going to keep pulling this. And this will tell me, make sure you keep that tight. This will tell me where the end is. No, that's, that's it's fairly close. It doesn't have to be perfect. You don't want to get this off very far. And now I'm going to take this loop right here at the end. Got a 50 foot extension cord that's about tw at 25 feet or so. Okay. Got this loop. I'm going to go back here where I plugged it in. I'm going to put these two together. I'm going to hang on to those. Now I'm going to straighten this cord out. Now I'm going to do my, my slip knots again. Okay, it's just I've got a double layer now to work with. I flip that through there, just like before. Through there, through there. Make sure you grab all four of them. You don't want to uh, just do three and forget about the fourth one because then you're going to have to unroll it a little bit to get started again. Okay, keep this out there straight. Pull up, hang on to it, grab the four. And just keep doing it. Okay, now. Once you're at the end, you're going to loop this through there again. At the end, all you're doing is looping it through so it's not going to come apart. Okay, now I can carry this. Look at that. There's your 50 foot extension cord. I can fold this up, whatever. Throw it down, however, I know it's not going to get all tangled up. As long as my end loop is long enough, I don't want to get the loop way too short. Okay? There it is. Now to undo it, just undo the very first loop, just the first one. From this end, you have to do the end that doesn't have the, uh, the extension cord end that we plug together. Don't go from that end. You'll never do it that, that way, okay? If you try, some people try to do it this way, it's just not going to work. You've got to find the loop. All right? Find that loop, undo one, and just start pulling it. I usually put my foot down here, that way kind of holds it. Now once I get it to there, I kind of try to unravel it a little bit. Okay, there's my, there's my cord. Unplug this, plug this into the wall, and I can straighten out the cord a little bit. Hope you like, I hope you like this way on how to roll up the extension cords. I mean, it gives you, it gives you some options. This is, this is a very good way to wrap up cords. If you get frustrated doing it the other way, if you have a heavy extension cord, a 12 gauge, 10 gauge, uh, this is really a lot easier than rolling up the old way, okay? Good luck.